Hi guys, G-Man here again. I uh, just wanted to do a real quick video about how to get the uh, steel out of the rubber tires. Um, one thing I have to say is uh, always use your safety protection. Use your goggles and gloves. And uh, also, uh, you'll see in a minute that I actually have a cutting wheel that I'm going to use to try to cut this stuff off. But first of all, I am going to try to cut the, uh, the rope that's in there. Apparently, it was the uh, first one was uh, used as a swing, so I'm going to try to get that cut off first, and then I'm going to go to the uh, the rubber itself and cut the cut around the rubber. My uh, recycler allows me about an inch or so of rubber around the uh, the steel rims, uh, so if I cut within that parameter, they'll take the steel rims at uh, of course the steel price. So here we go. Well, uh, apparently that was a quick failure. I'm going to uh, try something else on how to do it. Normally I use a knife, but I thought maybe this would be a little bit faster. And uh, actually it, uh, there's a little, a lot of fill out smoke, but that's about it. So I'm gonna go inside and I'm going to go get my knife and see how that works. Okay guys, I have, uh, cut the tire I've got it done and see what the end result is that's the tire that's the rest of the tire of course I'm just gonna roll that over there and then this is the rim that they will take so uh, Anyway, that's how I do it. I don't have any special tools to be able to do it with, but uh, that's how I do it. Now, I will say this. It is uh, pretty strenuous. It took me, I don't know, about 15 minutes to do that tire, uh, front and back. Uh, the knife gets very, very hot. So, uh, Anyway, that's it for that one, and uh, we're going to start on the, uh, the smaller one, I think, after I rest a little bit. All right, guys, I got the uh, second tire done. Same process, use the knife, cut it out, and of course, there's what's left of the outside of the tire. And then I've got the rim. Got that done. So, 
Both of them are done now. Alright guys, that's the end of my video on the uh, cutting of the tires. Um, I hope you learned something uh, because uh, I did. Uh, the moral of the story is don't use a cutoff wheel, use a regular knife, which that's what I usually use, but I thought maybe it would be a little bit faster with that. But uh, hey, <laughs> my redneck kicked in and <laughs> there you have it. So I hope you enjoyed the, the video. Uh, do me a favor, give me a comment, a like, and uh, subscribe down there at the bottom. And uh, I'll see you all later.